The final step is to uh, put interfacing into the side. So I'm going to fold my Peltex like this. I have double-sided Peltex, but if you only have sing or double-sided fusible Peltex, but if yours only fuses on one side, make sure that the fusible side goes towards the exterior. So I put it in here and I unfold it and work it towards the edges all the way around. And I'm not going to fuse it yet because first I need to sew it closed. So I'm going to take my length of thread. I prefer to sew with it doubled up. And I I will put my my needle right here. Put my needle in. All right, we're going to do what's called a ladder stitch. I hope this is visible even with the black thread. So I go in one side and out. Oops. Okay. Now I go towards the side towards me. And I'm going to work my way in. I go. I try to go directly across from where the thread is coming out. I put it in a little bit. Oops. Pull it tight. And I go across, directly across. Make a small stitch, pull it, and it pulls it tight. It's called ladder, a ladder stitch because you're going directly across over and over again, and up, and over, and, and every time that I, oops, every time that I make a stitch and pull it, it closes it. And when you're done, it is not very visible if you can do it nice and neatly. So let's see if I can get show how this pulls together. Whoop. And pulls it nice and closed. So that's what you do all the way across. And then when I'm done here, I'm going to turn the purse the other direction and, and put my other piece of interfacing on the other side and finish that as well. Then I can turn my purse right side out and it will be complete. So here is the finished hand sewn edge and uh, the stitches are invisible so you can't see them. Now I'm going to turn this right side out. And there it is. And I am going to iron this on my iron. and. Uh, fuse it so that it uh, is nice and stiff. But before I do that, I turn this and I repeat the same steps that I just did with the interfacing and the sewing on this side. And then my purse will be complete, except for the strap that I just need to attach. So then my purse will be complete. And here is the finished purse after it's been interfaced or interfaced and fused.
I do need to add the strap still, but uh, the purse itself is done. Inside, this one just has a little slip pocket on this side. This one has a slip pocket on one side and a zipper pocket on the other. So this will be for my daughter and I'm sure she will love it. 